Hey guys, it's Michaela, and today I'm going to walk you through when Twitter says we cannot currently register this phone number. Now, this is going to happen if you're trying to set up a new Twitter account or you're trying to change your phone number on your Twitter account, and it comes up with a message saying, like, we cannot register this number at this time. I'm going to walk you through four uh, reasons why they do this and a solution for them. The first reason is that you're putting in an inactive number or just a wrong number. If I'm putting in this random number, it's going to notice that it is a, not a real number or if you're putting in a real number and your carrier is not um, valid or you're not uh, currently like up to date on that, then your phone number is not going to work. It has to be a working phone number to work. The second reason that this is going to happen is that your phone number is connected to another active um, account on Twitter. Now this could be your active account that you know about or it could be you know somebody else has a previous account with that phone number linked to it and so Twitter is not going to let you sign in with this phone number. If this is the case where it's like you know you don't have another Twitter account but you uh, your phone number is not being like not allowed to be used then you should contact customer support and troubleshoot that as if somebody is using your number or if um, maybe there is some kind of a uh, fraud or anything like that. So once you do that, then you can go about that route if you know that you've never had a Twitter before and your phone number is still not being uh, able to connect. The third uh, reason why Twitter does this is that if your phone number is connected to a, a deactivated account, Twitter allows you to deactivate your accounts and after 30 days, you can then use that phone number that you had on your old account to start a new account. But if it's in within 30 days, um, Twitter is not going to allow you to go ahead and log in with that uh, phone number or create a new account with that phone number. It needs 30 days to process before you can go ahead and start that new account with that phone number. And the last reason that Twitter does this is because your phone number is associated with a suspended account. If you just get suspended or blocked and you try to just start a new Twitter, it will not allow you to do that. It's not going to it's going to recognize that phone number and it's just not let you it's not going to let you um, start that new Twitter account. But with all that said, a really quick way to go around this is using a Google Voice number, using a different number. So if I wanted to go out of this and download the app Google Voice, which you can just do in your app store, it's super easy and it's free. If I could spell um, here. The first one here, you can just go ahead and do it. And then once you sign up, you can sign up and it will give you a, a designated phone number for your Gmail account, your Google Voice account. And from there on, you can always use this number to verify codes. You can put it on all your different accounts if you'd like. And you can put on any uh, number of in, um, Twitter accounts. So you can go ahead and put in this new, this is my new Google Voice number next and it'll send a verification code you know you just go to your google voice you go to the messages click on that six two zero three five four verify and there we go now we have a brand new number with our tiktok account if you guys have any questions let us know if not don't forget to subscribe